so now so this is your rectangular in shape this is your rectangular in shape okay and this is the crease length this is the crease length this is your total height now total height of your this is the total height h this is your simply total h so now let us the small amount of water small amount of water flowing over the rear rectangular this is dy so now total area of this sphere is simply length into width that is area is equal length into area okay now velocity of we uh, over the rear uh, velocity of water flowing over we are simply that is your v equals to under root 2g y so it is came from your torricelli equation or torricelli theorem that is simply we can uh, derive from your uh, this equation has been derived from your bernoulli's uh, principle because see let us see this is your simply v here okay now the amount of water uh, speed of water at this condition it is a little bit higher and at this condition it is assumed the very low okay now at this condition pressure is exposed to atmosphere on the vr so that's why pressure has been considered at point this upstream side and this is the downstream side and the pressure at a upstream side okay and we measure here okay now so that is your b position this is your so a position now now pressure at both condition are zero and velocity at this condition water is very stable and this will low and water is flowing in this direction so velocity has been increasing so that is your vp at the b condition and elevation both are same that's why elevation uh, has been neglected and this is your simply h at the condition of your a how much amount of water has been stored that is called head that is the excess amount of water flowing over the v that's called we say we can say that your h okay at the point of your upstream okay now simplifying the above equation and substitute this is the uh, will go zero and this is also cancel and velocity at condition is zero and uh, ha that is called simply h this is your simply h okay here or simply uh, this is your b is zero now we got simply h equals to v square b by 2g so now what is the v at the b that is under root 2g h so now what is the h the excess amount of water flowing over so now here i here i am considering simply the excess amount of water flowing in dy that is your so under root 2g phi so now at this portion in this small portion see in this small portion in this small portion the amount of water flowing your q equals to area into velocity so that is the what is area d area equals to Length into d of your y. So similarly, so and we discussed just now. This is your simply area, and the discharge depends on your coefficient. That is your geometry of your crest. Okay, that is your CD. We can say that also we take into consideration. That is your CD. That is your uh, geometry of your wear, whether that is short crest or broad crest or your narrow crest or oval crest. Okay, we agree wear. So in this condition, CD is the uh, place measure of and simply area into velocity. Now I am simplifying the above equation from measuring total discharge. Total discharge of your entire wear from top to bottom. This entire distance from the this entire distance. That is your zero to h. Okay, integration C D L H Y into C constant area is your simply length into width velocity. So simplifying this equation, I am keeping common C D L root is common and y integration of the your d y. So integration of equation C D L and root is common and integration of your uh, y one by two is simply your So x power of n equation x power of n plus one by n plus one. In this manner, I am writing the equation. And now the h is substituted instead of your y. So we got three by two and zero is mean zero. So now this is your simply two by third c d l under root two g h three by two. This is the rectangular wear formula. This is the most important. And where you know the g is the acceleration due to gravity. I am substituting the g is equal nine point eight one. And the crest C D is equal to zero point two three six two three zero point six two three. This is the coefficient of discharge for a particular rectangular wear. And L is the same crest length. So substitute the above values and we get the discharge is simply manner. Okay, in this one point eight four L h power of three by two. Okay, now here the discharge 
and meter to per second L is length of fish to your mean meter side due to that of water flowing over the air that is in meter so similarly the equation if I am converting into the liter per second liter per second and heading is centimeter because the in field condition very less the amount of water flows uh, in the centimeters in this condition we can measure the amount of water in liter per second in this condition we use distribution okay this is the Q is equal to 0.0184 L h power of 3 by 2 Okay, how it escape means uh, it is meter cube per second. I am converting in the meter cube, uh, liters per second and keeping the constant 1.84 1.84 L in converting into meters. So converting into centimeter that is your 100 and H also be 100 power of 3 by 2 because I am converting into centimeter all dimensions. So please simplify the equation, you will get this equation. Find the discharge particular uh, triangular here. So let us see sides of your. Uh, canal okay now see this is the small amount of water flowing over this particular uh, uh, weir so that's can say that this is your dy small depth of water flowing over weir okay this is your one more triangle okay can i say this is one more triangle and this is also another triangle big triangle okay now similarly i'm drawing this is your top okay and this is your bottom see the uh, cross-sectional area cross sectional area of your uh, we are simply simply that your uh, area length into that is your x of your total length of this here this is the x simple this is x and depth how much amount of water flowing that is very small that is your dy that is your dy okay now the width of this particular strip what this is strip now i want to find the width of this particular strip the width of particular strip from your right angle because i will divide this into the triangle shape so now this is so it will make right angle here 90 degree okay and this is also similarly here this is the 90 degree so now this is the one triangle and this is the another triangle so if when i know the 90 degrees i can easily find out the width of the strip so this is the one and this is two so let us see this is the total width to b so this is the b by 2 this is also b b by 2 okay now similarly the depth of water total head is the h total head this is your simply y simply this is the y so what is this this is the h minus y so now simply the width of the strip from your right angle o d e o d e is equal to here o d e o d e that is equal tan theta by 2 because this half total angle is theta this is the theta this is the theta by 2 okay o d e that is your tan theta by 2 okay now that is our total this is your simple b by 2 this is off okay odf of b by 2 okay now height total height so this is the total height big triangle that is called very simply h okay now o d f o d f that is called b by 2 by h okay now what is the b here b is a 2h tan theta by 2 let us see equation and from the smaller triangular from the small triangular o a b o a b o a b and this o d both are similar okay now from the equal shape of triangular we can the uh, small triangular length length of this width of the small strip x by total big triangle width is equal to b that equal to depth head that is equal to h minus y smaller triangular h minus y divided by big triangular that is h okay and simplifying the x equals to we get this one and now area of the tip area so area is equal to simply dx into x into dy that okay small strip that is your da is equal to x into dy that is equal to x so what is x 2 h minus y tan theta by 2 I am substituting and dy it is simply dy okay this is the simply area of this small strip this small strip okay now I want to find the entire area and discharge so you know the velocity of this uh, your uh, wear similar this is similar to the your triangular uh, rectangular wear that is your comes from your torsion equation but v is equal to under root 2g y okay now discharge of our wear total discharge that is equal to simply dq small discharge is a particular portion dq is equal to cd and a into v that cd also know that this simply uh, because here the cd also be geometry of your uh, crest or wear 
that will play a major role that's why area and velocity is cd so now total discharge integrating from the bottom to top from here to top okay now this is your top so similarly 0 to h sim all 2 into cd h minus y tan theta by 2 under root 2g into dy okay now i'm simplifying that all keeping constants uh, outside 2d tan theta by 2 under 2g is common and h because head in uh, play head and y this small head okay now simplify the above equation similar to the root of x equals to x 1 by 2 plus 1 by 1 by 2 plus 1 so in this manner i am simplifying the root of uh, y that is where we get the this is your simple sorry y okay simplifying this equation i will get the uh, 8 by 15 cd tan theta by 2 2 g h 5 power of 2 and similarly the cd is a coefficient of discharge that we have varied 0 0.2 uh, 5852 0 0.60 now here if i am keeping the above equation uh, into substituting similarly 8 by 15 into 0 0.5 into uh, tan theta is equal to 90 90 by 2 tan 45 into uh, root 2g into 9.81 so what i'll get simply i will get q is equals to 1.38 h power of 5 by 2 here in the terms of your liter per second or centi uh, centimeter so if we substitute the above equation and we get the q is equal to 0 0.138 h power of 5 by 2